Investigators are searching for the cause of a fire which destroyed two homes in Shreveport's Highland neighborhood this morning. Good evening. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Dan Jovic. And I'm Jackie Jovic. Firefighters are calling it suspicious because there was no power to the homes and they were supposed to be vacant. It's tonight's top story. I was like, I'm hoping nobody's in there and got hurt. Two homes engulfed in flames, sending billows of smoke high into the sky. Just dropping off the kids at school and we seen the smoke from like a mile away and when we came, the trees was on fire, the house was on fire, it was just out of control, it was just terrible. It happened near the corner of Wall and Market Streets. The fire broke out just before 8 a.m. Three dozen firefighters worked to get the flames under control. The first unit on scene arrived, stated that there was heavy flames and smoke coming from the rear of the structure. Uh, quickly, all occupants had escaped. Firefighters say three people were in the homes at the time. Two were taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. While the flames were contained to those two houses, a neighboring business did sustain some damage. Uh, smoke probably as much as anything. I hope the embers hadn't lit, any, lit up anything inside the attic. Wayne Neeson says he's been concerned about fire hazards in the neighborhood for a while. They burn tires over there regularly. There's stacks of tires, old tires there, just general debris. The Salvation Army is helping the three men find housing. Investigators say they don't have an official cause of that fire yet, but they do know one of the men was smoking in a bedroom when the fire started.